Welcome to the Creative Pugza. In this tutorial, you'll learn how to create light rays in Affinity Photo. With this effect, you'll be able to add light rays to landscape images or other images that you weren't able to capture light on camera. You can also use this effect to add light coming through a window. First, go to File Open and select the downloaded image. Second, press Ctrl and J to make a copy of the image. In the Layers panel, turn the original picture off. I want to make the image a little less green. In the Layers panel, click the Adjustments icon and select the Curves Adjustment. Go to the green channel. Next, place a point in the middle of the curve and drag it down. Now, go to the Master channel and add a point in the middle of the curve. Then, drag the point up slightly to brighten the image. After that, select the duplicated background layer. Go to the Select menu. Then go to Tone Arrange Select Highlights. We want to make the highlights in this image brighter. Now go to the Layers panel and click the Adjustments icon. Select the Shadows Highlights Adjustment. This will place our selection onto a new layer. Set the highlights to 70% and label this layer Highlights. Then press Ctrl and D to deselect. It's time to create the light rays. We'll create three light sources on separate layers to create one light ray. Each of these layers will add depth to the light ray. Select the duplicated background image in the Layers panel. Grab the Freehand Selection tool from the Tools panel. In the Context toolbar, set the type to Polygonal. Take the tool and place a point in front of the man. Then drag the line diagonally to the right and off the document. Make your selection the same way you see it on the screen. After that, go to the Layers panel and click the Adjustments icon and select the Curves Adjustment. Place a point in the middle and drag it up to brighten this area. Then press Ctrl and D to deselect. Label this layer Light 1. With the Light 1 layer still selected, go to the Filters menu and select Blur Gaussian Blur. Set the radius to 40 pixels. Next, grab the Freehand Selection tool again. Select the background layer. Take the tool and make a second selection inside of the previous selection we made. Click the Adjustments icon in the Layers panel and select the Curves Adjustment. Place the point in the middle and drag it up. Press Ctrl and D to deselect. Now go to the Filters menu. Select Blur Gaussian Blur. Set the radius to 30 pixels. In the Layers panel, label this layer Light 2 and drag it above the Light 1 layer. After that, select the background. Next, grab the Freehand Selection tool. Make a smaller selection inside of the second selection we created. Go to the Layers panel and click the Curves Adjustment. Place a point in the middle and drag the point up. Press Ctrl and D to deselect. Next, go to the Filters menu. Then select Blur Gaussian Blur. Set the radius to 15 pixels. In the Layers panel, label it Light 3. Drag this layer above the Light 2 layer. Now go to the Layers panel and click the Adjustments icon. Select the Curves Adjustment. Click on the middle of the curve to add a point and drag it up some to brighten the image. Once you've done that, click the Add Pixel Layer icon in the Layers panel to add a new layer. We want to add some fog or mist to the scene to make the light ray more realistic. Grab the paintbrush tool from the tools panel. In the swatches panel, select the white color for the fill color. Next, go to the layers panel and select the pixel layer we added. Then take the brush and paint around the bottom area of the light ray.
also add some white slightly along the actual ray of light. After that, lower the opacity of this layer to about 88%. Label this layer fog. I want to darken the shadows in the image, so we'll select the shadows. Select the background layer and the layers panel. Next, go to the Select menu and click Tonal Range, Select Shadows. In the Layers panel, click the Adjustments icon and select the Shadows Highlights Adjustment. Set the shadows to negative 60%. Label this layer Shadows. This step is optional, but we can add a little bit of texture to this image. Click the Add Pixel Layer icon in the Layers panel. Go to the Swatches panel and select Black for the fill color. With the new layer selected, go to the Edit menu and select Fill with Primary Color to fill the layer with black. Then, go to the Filters menu. Select Noise, Add Noise. Set the intensity to 100%. Select Gaussian to make sure the monochromatic box is checked. In the Layers panel, set the blend mode of this layer to Overlay and lower the opacity to 25%. And this is how to create light rays in Affinity Photo. If you've enjoyed watching this video, please give it a thumbs up, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, hit the bell icon to turn on post notifications so you never miss an upload. Thank you for watching.